Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus giving you uh, draft champions. I'm uh, going to be using using the Seattle Seahawks playbook. I'm already building out uh, my my schemes for the Philadelphia playbook, and I just I really haven't had a lot of time to go ahead and uh, finish this series up with Seattle. But um, we'll see how things work out. I'm I'm kind of I'm just uh, I'm not really in the mindset with this this playbook now. I've already jumped into another one. But let's just take a look at our, our lineup that we drafted. I drafted this a while back. Uh, offensive line, I didn't really have anybody fall to me at all except for Tyron Smith, so I've got a nice good left tackle. Uh, offensively, we've got Jordan Reed, which he's going to be a very good wide receiver, and then Clay. So those guys, those guys are going to be very good for me. Wide receivers, Devontae Parker fell to me. I've got Emmanuel Sanders uh, and also Deshaun Jackson. Oh, those are my guys. And then my running back has got fairly good speed in Talvin Coleman. So I'm going to definitely take it. And then Warren Moon was my quarterback. Uh, a lot of good attributes. I like how that is. On defense, I drafted. I didn't really have the best drafts. Um, it got extra, uh, basically an extra safety. Didn't really need that. Um, but I, I got Ron, uh, Ron Parker. Uh, I've got my left end at the uh, linebacker position because I need some speed. So 83 speed out here. 84 with Anthony Barr. And Eric Hendricks is going to be my user that will be using middle, uh, middle linebacker over the middle. Steve Atwater, and then I've got Grimes, and I've got Richard Sermon as my corners. And then on defensive end, I've got Mike Daniels. On the other side, I've got uh, Cameron Wake. So hopefully I'll get some pretty good block shedding, some good power moves to go and get some sacks against these guys. Uh, as far as uh, my slot uh, slot corner, I picked up Anthony, uh, Anthony Brown, and in my fourth um, uh, corner is going to be my free safety. Uh, he's got fairly good speed, so I might have some pressure coming off the edge. So this is my team. Once again, rolling with the... Um, uh, Seattle Seahawks playbook. So let's go ahead and jump into a game uh, and see how we can do. Um, I just I haven't really been grinding a lot of games lately because the, the holidays has been very hectic. So uh, hopefully I'll, pro I'll get a good matchup uh, here and get a good gameplay for you guys. Uh, but if I look a little bit rusty with the offense, is because I'm really my mind's in Philadelphia, um, and uh, hopefully I can just pick up the stuff I was doing in Seattle uh, against live ranked opponents. So uh, right now it's in the middle of January. Down here in Florida, we actually got very cold temperatures. It's uh, it, dipping down into the 30s. <clears throat> so it's not something we're usually used to doing. So uh, tonight is going to be a cold night here for us uh, in, the t in the Florida state. Where are you guys from? Uh, let me know. Uh, go ahead and make a, a comment in the notes. And just let me know where you guys are from. I'm just curious, and my subscribers, the guys who watch these full game videos, uh, where you guys are from and, you know, uh, what areas you're from and just out of curiosity like uh, how old you guys too because uh, uh, I just uh, I saw something on Facebook uh, where a bunch of guys were listing their ages and it's somewhat interesting to see that all right so gonna go against Buffalo's finest 79 that's my team and let's see what our opponent's got he's got better player cards than me man look at that he's got a lot better cards he might, might have drafted at a different time than I did I drafted this draft a long time ago so hopefully scheme over team and we'll be able to go ahead and get a, a victory against uh, against this guy. So we're kicking off, getting the ball in the second half. That's definitely the way we like it. He's rolling with uh, the Falcons playbook or uh, uniforms, and I've got the Orbits as my uniforms. All right, so able to go ahead, get cross right there, and get him down to the 21. So it's a win uh, for the uh, for for return because he did not get it up to the 25. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna come out. The um, out of the uh, 43 wide nine, and there should be a free blitzer on this right now. I'm going to take Gronk out. <laughs> He's taking a long time. I know what's going on with this guy. He makes a switch. He's not going to be able to flip this up, uh, and it takes a delay of game. So that's not a good way to go ahead and start. We're going to go ahead and take it. If we're going to get a, get a freebie, you might as well. All right, we're going to come out of the uh, Sand Blitz 3. And nice little swipe up animation. He actually tosses it up. And I don't know what he was thinking there. Uh, that was not a good play for him. We're going to do cover two invert. Just 
screenplay. That was a good call. I got caught up in the blockers and went over too far. And got him with the pressure off the edge right there by Cameron Wake. So fourth and 16. Punting it is not a smart thing to do, but uh, he's got to make me earn it. Take Coleman and put him back. And that didn't look like a good punt at all. A terrible punt. So this guy's screaming rookie. Um, and this is, you know, it's a good situation for me, but it's, it's not fun for you guys to watch. So let's go on a pistol. We're going to go ahead and take quick slants, turn that into like a cross. And we're just going to come out of the strong power. Flip the play. There you go. So got some pretty good blocking right there. Be able to get a nice little six yard gainer. He went with a corner blitz. Alright, so we're gonna come out here, Ohio spacing. We're gonna put that in stick and nod for verticals. We're gonna put that is Post wheel drag, and we're gonna come out of the Owen trap. I need to get up, up to the line. And I have to snap the ball and run it. Oof, almost broke a tackle right there. Um, not very good stick, but that's all right. You got some more positive yards. wheel drag. I'm going to jump into a draw play. And that was a blitz. I think it was a man blitz. <clears throat> so that was a man blitz. So we're in a good position right now. We can get the three points, go up on him by a score, we get the ball in the second half. He's pressing. And nice block shed right there. I have nobody on my offensive line. They're all golds, so that's going to be a problem for me. So let's go into post wheel drag. I need to go into bunch. I forgot about uh, bunch uh, formation. So it just I have a board I usually fall to, uh, I default to uh, that I look at when I'm playing the game, uh, just to go ahead and just make sure I'm making making sure I'm following the schemes that I actually have built out for you guys. Let's see if we can get him with Jackson. Good blitz. A really good blitz right there. I had no time. Uh, he came into the man blitz, and I didn't have um, didn't have myself set up with a, with a man read. So if he keeps hitting with man blitzes, I'm going to basically destroy this guy. And I might have missed that. I missed it. I missed the ax. I missed the kick. Um, I, I was looking at him um, making his adjustments. And it just messed up my timing. Oh, that was, he just caught it right in front of my defensive back. There you go. Grimes is able to make a play for me right there. 
He threw in a coverage. He thought he had a seam, and Grimes was able to come up for a big play for me right there on bench. So uh, that definitely worked out for me. Let's see if he just keeps hitting me with. Um, let's see if he keeps hitting me with this um, off coverage. Okay, I'm gonna hit him with an out. Yep. Uh, just a bad, just a high pass right there. So he went right back to that man stuff. Do you want trap here? <clears throat> Dude, that guy just came right, just bar barely right off the line, and caught my my, my guy in the backfield. So he's using a lot of man coverage against me. So I got to use some man beaters. Um. There you go. <clears throat> wow. You see that hit stick right there? Actually, it was the right read, and he was able to go ahead and get off a, a lucky hit stick right there to go ahead and keep it interesting. So he's just staying with this man blitz. I'm going to go ahead and try to get some points on the board against this guy. And he's, he's clicking on and getting pretty good action. So I've been, I've been able to go ahead and get a couple stops against this guy, but my offense is not looking good right now. And a lot of it I think has to do is that I didn't get any offensive linemen. So that's just, word, just a note. I did not miss this again. Come on. Wow, my timing's off completely with this kicker. I'm not, I'm not hitting anything at all. I've been grinding a lot of solos. Uh, I've been sucked up in solo land because that's the only thing I can really get away with in, in between the books. So uh, my timing, my kicking is off. Should be at least a six and nothing lead right now. I'm just letting this guy. I'm keeping this guy in his game. Um, I'm not getting the blocking I need, and he's getting a real good block shot off the line. So maybe I need to go back to that um, um, <coughs> pistol formation against him. Oh god, look at this. Look at this crap, man. Look at that. Oh my lord. This guy he hasn't done anything the entire time and he gets a kickoff return. That's why these mud games are interesting because of stuff like that. You get the stuff that uh, basically make these games interesting. This could this should potentially be a 14-7 uh, game. Uh, but I've I've had some block shits and stuff like that. This guy's gonna keep me. He's gonna keep hitting me with blitzes because I have no pressure. I have like um, there you go. All right, so that was garbage. This guy's screwing around. So uh, you know my my first take is this guy's a bum, and I'm sure maybe he's a good player. I don't know, but I haven't seen anything from this guy that shows that he is a good player uh, because uh, he's. He's only broken a kickoff return, and anybody uh, that, that anybody who picks up this game could, game could uh, basically get that type of um, animation or that type of stuff. So, once again, I don't think this guy is that good of a player. Right, so, is he staying in that man blitz? Now he went to the corner strike. So he rushed his outside edge rusher, which is usually not something you see a lot happening. Let's go into pistol. Oh, 
I know I shouldn't do this. He's been so aggressive with his blitzing. And I was too close. Um, 40 yards out, that would have been a touchdown. So that was just that was bad play calling by me. Um, <clears throat> I was 30 yards in, so it would have been a touchdown if I if I would just if I, w I was uh, further out. So that's just yeah, it was just a bad decision by me. There you go. So really good blocking right there. I, what I've been doing with that uh, corner post play is I take the backside tight end um, and basically put him on a slant route to give me additional route um, on that side. I always look to the side with the flat and uh, the flat circle route. Um, uh, it just it's the it's where I'm going to go with the ball anyway. So I like to have a backside receiver that I can hit over the middle to just keep him guessing. All right, so up 10 to 6. Um, you could have made this game a little bit more interesting. Let's see if we can go ahead and stop this guy's massive kickoff offense. Uh, you guys got freaking uh, Devin Hester back here returning kickoffs for him. Buffalo's fine at 79. And that was a bad kick. What is going on with this return team? These guys are not making plays for me. All right, so we're going to go back to the blitz. We're going to do... So Grimes is able to go ahead and make a play for me. This guy's just lofting it up. One interception. He's not really making any uh, any kind of uh, move at all. Let's see if we can go ahead and hit him with some pressure. And connection to the game uh, has been lost. So I don't know if he quit. I don't think he quit. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, but this is not a, that's not a good way to go ahead and start this series, guys. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to post this game. I think I might. Um, it wasn't a very good game at all, but uh, once again, guys, thank you for your support. I really appreciate it. Uh, I just want to show you some of these gameplays uh, so you can see it firsthand, uh, how these schemes work, some of the reads and adjustments I made. So there was, there was a couple good tips you might, you might have been able to pick up from it. So I'll probably jump into another gameplay to try to push through this series. But once again, to my subscribers, thank you for your support, and until next time.